Hey guys, this is Argon657 here with another Pokemon Aura's Wi Fi battle. This battle is against Inigo, so I hope you guys enjoy the video. I'm gonna start off with my Drift Blimp. He's gonna start off with his Slowbro. And he's gonna switch out immediately into his Hydreigon, expecting me to go for the Shadow Ball. I went for the Protect, expecting him to uh, stay in and possibly going for a Scald or something like that. Um, I'm going to go to my Greninja expecting the Dark Pulse and then he's going to expect me to go for the Ice Beam and uh, which I go for and uh, he's going to put his Kecleon and uh, that was a crit though so this Kecleon this Kecleon is probably uh, especially defensive um, because they took the crit pretty well um, he's gonna go for the fake out, and um, fake out does does nothing. So I can pretty much um, just eat up his uh, shadow sneaks, his sucker punches, and all that. I'm gonna go for the rocks, um, and then now I'm gonna go for the dragon tail as he goes for a sucker punch. I know I can take that as well, cause um, I'm physically defensive, so really won't do that much damage. Uh, I'm going to phase him out into his Dust Clubs, uh, which is unfortunate because now I have to switch out because he's going to go for the Will-O-Wisp. So my best bet is going into my um, Drift Blim. And he does go for the Will-O-Wisp. And um, I'm going to go for a uh, Shadow Ball. Expecting him to... Actually, no. Never mind. I, I'm actually going for the Charge Beam because... Um, I wanted to get a special attack raise, but he goes into his Kecleon as Death Fodder, so uh, I won't be able to get the special attack raise. He goes into his Mammoth Swine. I'm expecting the Ice Shard. Um, I'm going to go to my Starmie to sponge that. He's going to go for the Rocks instead, and then he's going to switch out expecting me to go for the Scald. So he's going to go to his Parasect. I do go for the Scald. Um, unfortunately, I do not get the burn. And um, I'm going to switch out uh, into my Drift Blame, expecting the Spore, because I know that I'm already burned and he can't put another status on me. So, um, yeah, so I'm going to go for the Shadow Ball over here. And. Um, <laughs> Yeah, he's going to get his Dust Clubs. The Shadow Ball is going to be an easy two-hit KO. It does a lot to EV Light Dust Clubs because of the Flare Boost. Um, but I got a little greedy there and decided to go for a Charge Beam. And I could have taken him out with another Shadow Ball, but I thought I could get a Special Attack Raise and take him out. But unfortunately, that's not the case, and he's able to take me out with the Nightshade along with the Burn. Um, now I'm going to go to my Pidgeot, and I'm not going to overpredict again, so I'm just going to go straight for the Hurricane. I'm um, expecting him to either stay in or switch out, it doesn't matter. Um, I can hit any Pokemon that he goes into. So now he's going to go to his Mammoth Swine, and I'm going to switch out expecting the Ice Shard or Icicle Crash. Um... He's going to go for the Earthquake and just take me out. He makes a good play there. So, um, the fact that he went for an Earthquake um, while I was in my Pidgeot tells me that he was predicting me to switch out. So now, I'm going to go to my Greninja. He's going to go for the Ice Shard. Um, and then, um, I'm going to be able to just take him out with the Surf. Um, I am Life Orb, so... Um, but he's going to go to his Hydreigon. He's probably going to be faster than me, so. Um, he's going to go for the Draco Meteor and just take me out. I uh, thought he would go for a Dark Pulse because that would have been a better move because now he's at uh, minus two special attack. Um, so I'm going to go to my Tyrantrum. I know I can take a Draco Meteor. So he's going to switch out into his Slowbro. And I'm going to go for a Dragon Tail to phase him out. And then he's going to go into his Parasect. 
Um, I'm gonna go for um, a crunch over here because uh, just want to be able to take him out or get the defense drop. And the effect spore takes effect, but uh, which is good because I get poisoned as he goes for a spore, so you won't be able to put me to sleep. So um, my tarantula won't be uh, put to sleep because of the poison. Um, and then I'm going to go for the dragon tail to phase him out again. So he's going to go to slow bro. Um, this kind of tells me that this is his mega slow bro because I don't see an item. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go for the crunch. Um, just try to get the defense drop so that way the crunches will do more. Um, I'm going to try to fish for the crunch, uh, defense drop, and, uh, I don't get the defense drop, and the thing is with Mega Slowbro, you cannot crit it because of its ability, so it prevents, uh, Pokemon from getting critted, so, I'm just going to keep going for the crunch, he's going to go for the slock off, I think he's slowly stalling me out, so, um, I'm going to keep going for the crunches and uh, just hope for the best, even though I won't get any crits because of its ability. I'm just hoping for the defense drop. He's going to keep on going for the slack off. The poison is kind of slowly wearing me down because of the um, uh, stalling and everything. And um, Slowbro is taking his crunches too well. Um, even though I have the strong draw ability, but it's not stab, so it's not going to do, um, a whole lot of damage, so. Um, he's going to finally switch out into his, um, Parasect, and, uh, I'll be able to at least take out the Parasect with the Crunch. So now the Parasect's gone, and now, um, he's going to go for, um, his Hydreigon, and he's going to finish me off with a Dark Pulse. Um, so now, I'm going to go to my Rhyperior, and I know that um, his last two remaining Pokemon are weak to Bug-type moves, so I'm going to expect him to go to his Slow Bro, expecting me to go for the Ice Punch. Um, but instead, I predict him to go to Slurbro and I'm gonna go for the choice banded Mega Megahorn and it's gonna be an easy to hit KO. So Slurbro is gone, now his last Pokemon is his Hydreigon. And now um he's gonna go for the Dark Pulse. I do live it and uh luckily I don't get the flinch and I don't miss the Megahorn and I'll be able to take this Hydreigon out. So that is good game. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a comment below. Uh, click the like button and subscribe. And I will see you guys later.